Hi, this is Tom Shanahan of SpiritualAdrenaline.com. I'm here today with Todd Smith. Todd is a trainer at Addict to Athlete in beautiful Pueblo, Colorado, and he just ran three miles in the Hero Run that's sponsored by Addict to Athlete. Todd, thank you so much for coming out today. Just tell me what the Hero Run's about and what Addict to Athlete does. Well, first off, the Hero Run is a chance for the community to get into an event. Um, it's $25, they get a t-shirt, and the proceeds go to some local um, organization or foundation. Uh, this year it's actually going towards our Sober Living program, which helps addicts that get into uh, recovery from um, either jail or from treatment to have a safe place to live and so that they can start their life on a better foot. That's awesome. And what do you do at Addict Athlete? You're a trainer, correct? Yes, uh, I'm considered a coach. Uh, what I do is um, I help with the classes. So we have a curriculum that we run over with, with all the clients, and um, which range anywhere from changing you know behaviors and trying to think differently and help them understand that uh, not only are they a human being, but there's uh, a positive way that they can change. And uh, we also do a fitness side of it. So we do. Um, you know, kind of semi-CrossFit kind of things with them to break them into uh, the CrossFit culture and help them kind of sweat out some of the toxins and, you know, get the feel-good stuff rolling. Why do you folks use CrossFit as the model at Addict Athlete? What, what, what is it about CrossFit that you think uh, people in substance abuse recovery can relate to? Well, for one, I think it's really good. Uh, there's a cardio aspect and um, a technical aspect of it that not only gets your, your body pumping, you know, blood and, and, and delivering, you know, good chemicals, but there's a, there's a mental side of it. You know, it's difficult. Um, at times, you have to structure it mentally, and, and it helps people start thinking about, you know, how to structure their life. And, and really, there's also an atmosphere about it, too. You know, it's not just a, a group of friends. You become more of a family, and it gives people a sense of belonging and, and gives them something to, you know, improve themselves for. And what brought you to this place? I'm just curious about the background that brought you to Addict Athlete. Well, with me, you know, it uh, started about four and a half years ago. Um, I was heavily into uh, drugs. I was using heroin and uh, went through a good eight days of withdrawals in jail and, um, you know, ended up suffering seizures, concussions. Um, that eighth day, I ended up having a heart attack, uh, which during my kidneys and liver failed. Um, ended up... How old, how old were you? Uh, I was 27. Wow. And now I'm, I'll be 32 in a couple weeks. And um, I woke up. And, you know, there was a uh, jail guard above me and resuscitated me. And I got to the hospital and found out that I had three broken ribs, a broken nose. Um, I, they didn't know if I was going to make it through the night. I went from 150 pounds to 96. And being six foot tall, that's kind of, you know, kind of difficult to, you know, difficult pill to swallow. But um, it was then and there that I decided, you know, I'm the one who's in control of my life. And I need to, I need to take control and do something for the betterment of myself and for others. So that's how I got in the program. Wow, wow. And when you're working with newcomers to CrossFit or newcomers to the Addict to Athlete program, what's it like? What, what, do you, what, what recommendations do you have for people out there who maybe are in a bad place like you were or I was and don't believe it's going to get better? Well, first of all, you know, there is hope. Um, we have, you know, quite a few people out there that are doing this, like me and you who are doing this interview, um, who have seen the darkest of places, but, you know, we're in the brightest of places too. Um, so for one, there is hope. And for two, you know, for people who come to the program new, you know, everybody's a little bit different. You know, some are a little hesitant, some are, you know, you know, gung-ho about it. Um, and, you know, with, with my experience and the more people I deal with, it makes it easier to kind of help those people um, because one person is different than the next but ultimately we all, we all share a bond we all have things in common that you know what we were doing was not working and there is a group of people that can actually help you change it into what will work that's amazing you're doing god's work you're saving lives every day so thank you so much for taking the time congratulations on running the three miles here in pueblo today if you're interested in more about what todd does you can visit the website for addict to athlete at addict to athlete dot org. Thank you so much.